This is Two Minute Toots, where we show you a digital fashion tip in two minutes or less. About a year ago, I created this video. And it was all about how to easily create straps on a dress. And a lot of people liked it. And one person said to me, that was great, but I was really hoping you would show how to create the shirring on the dress. So that's what we're gonna talk about today. The shirring on the dress is made with a pattern brush. First, drag a guide to make sure you create the brush straight. And then draw a dashed line for the stitching. And the line is at least five eighths to three quarters of an inch. I do this so the gathers on the pattern brush will look a little less uniform. You can even increase the width to a full inch. To create the gathers on either side of the line, I use width profile number four. Once you've created your gathers, create a definition box. Remember that it should have no fill and stroke and set to the back before selecting the box and the rest of your artwork and dragging it into the brushes panel. Choose pattern brush. And once the brushes options come up, you can name the brush and specify a colorization method. To use the brush, just draw a line where the shirring should appear and then apply the brush to the line. Now, if you need to learn more about brushes, you can check out these videos on my channel, which will help you learn how to properly create them, color them. It'll explain about the definition box, all that good stuff. Thanks for watching this week's video. Make sure you check out the links in the description for more information about my classes, to get some great freebies, or to schedule a call to discuss your design goals. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video if you found it helpful. Have a fantastic week, and I'll see you next time.